This video is going to be about a vegetarian's uh, French tip. I got this Beyond Steak plant based seared tips. They're new. It says new. They, they had something before. I think it was Gardein. Walmart used to carry it, but they stopped stocking it. I just got the pan lightly oiled. And I got three cups of water for the odd juice. Gravy from McCormick it says right here. Total cook time five minutes. Just has to boil the water. Needs to boil uh, three cups cold water, one pack of this mix. And uh, just uh, heat till it comes to a little boil. And then that's it. I'm gonna. Cook these with uh, a little bit of seasoned salt. Um, spread that out a little. Uh, just on medium, maybe medium, medium, low, medium, high, maybe. Maybe just medium. I'll just turn it to medium and uh, season them. A little seasoned salt. This brand, uh, this is the great value one. Usually I use the Lari's, but this time I bought this one. A little seasoned salt on. It's probably plenty. I got this uh, Montreal steak seasoning. It really helps add some flavor to this. And the odd juice sauce, of course. I put a little black pepper, crushed ground black pepper, and uh, cover it for about cover it. I'm gonna put a little fresh black pepper, and I got a just a French bread loaf from Walmart. I got the black pepper on there. I'm just going to spray a little more cooking spray on the side that's facing up. I haven't turned any of it yet. Go maybe like, uh, maybe like five minutes on medium each side. And then cut the French bread in half. I guess I could start the uh, uh, a juice sauce. Let's put it on medium high, I guess. By the time this is almost done, I've turned it over, stirred it once. Uh, the water should be boiling, then I'll whisk in the pack of brown gravy. Or, I mean, not brown gravy, uh, I'll juice sauce, sorry. Uh, I got this Beyond Steaks plant based tips at uh, Sprouts grocery store. I'm adding the a juice gravy I guess they call it I just call it juice sauce to the hot water I got this seasoned again I'm gonna put it on low I think it's cooked enough I re-season it with some more seasoned salt Montreal steak seasoning and I've sliced my bread here it's a whole loop I'm just gonna put it on I don't have any cheese or probably put mozzarella or provolone maybe I'm just gonna whisk this while it heats up tomorrow. I'm gonna split on high from medium high to get to boil for like a minute. It didn't take long, it took maybe like eight minutes for this to cook. This uh, Beyond Steak tip, seared tip. And I'm about to get this ready. Just need to bubble a little bit and then that's it. It's ready. Stir this one more. And it helps to add a little more seasoning in that. I just put a, like a tablespoon or two, maybe three at the most. 
Just a little puddle of vegetable oil and heat it before I put the seared steak tips or vegetarian in. Seared tips. This one good. I've had the other one that was steak strips. I wish they didn't stop selling at Walmart because it tasted really good on these vegetarian.